All right, now we are going to, from uh, here, we are going to learn more about the uh, malware functionalities. Right? It mentions what malware can have multiple functionalities. And it is, uh, unfortunately, we have limited time. We cannot go through you know, all the different types of functionalities, but we are going to you know, uh, see you know, a few of them okay, in, during this class. And so all the functionalities are you know, implemented you know, to support the you know, malware's goal. And I just put, you know, some of the goal, maybe, you know, malware's goal, maybe you want to, you know, steal, steal some information, or you can actually attack some, you know, in fact, as many as, you know, machine and then do some, you know, DDoS, you know, there's this distributed denial of service attack, right? So uh, they can be just you know, some different goals. But for here, rather than we were going to talk about the functionalities rather than actual goal of certain you know, malware. So this is more technical in you know, a focus. Okay. And for here, right, for this uh, today, uh, we will have a basically we'll go through the uh, actually yes. So since I just listed some of the functionalities, again, okay, there can be more functionalities, but I listed the functionalities that we are going to see during this class. Okay? And I have a sample for you know, all these functionalities. And others can be you know, screen capturing, but we are not going to see it during the class. And a password dumping or you know, encrypting files that just can be uh, uh, dumped by the ransomware. 